It's too much! We could be like an eternity. I only want your love, your love, your love. Yo, what's up? I made you a free singing lesson. It's 10 minutes. The link is in the YouTube description and in the top comment. You are going to be shocked if you record your voice before it. 20 seconds on voice memos. Go through my lesson. Follow along, record the same 20 seconds, compare those two audios. I believe you're going to be shocked. Over half a million people have been through that lesson. Everyone here is an immediate improvement. So go try it. It's going to prove to you that you have what it takes to be a singer just like me. I used to have a terrible voice. I'm a professional. Thousands of people. So give that a try. Let me know how it goes. This video is titled Times When Dimash Had Fun With His Voice or forgot that he's still human we're about to freak out together make sure that you give me your opinion after you watch mine in the comments okay let's go imagine that even without a mic how loud that would be the mic's way back here Little baby Dimash. Was an alien back then, still is with that voice. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Let me hear that one more time. Let me hear that one more time. Yeah, gosh. Quick little micro adjustments of the vocal cords. It just deserves one of these faces the whole time. Just Those beautiful little whistle notes is just like to a vocal coach. It's like boom, boom, boom. So good. Yes, 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 yes. Are we gonna pretend like that's not just happening? My gosh, I could. This should be like this could be an hour-long breakdown, and you would be like, "Just get back to the boss." So I will spare you on that. But let me just tell you, mastery right there. Amazing book. Everyone needs to read it. Robert Green, mastery. Robert Green, mastery. In an age of endless distraction and God bless TikTok, I have someone post on it for me. But I mean, it's like attention spans. I'm getting so low! Most people are not diving into a skill like Dimash. Like, they're not staying what you call monomaniacally focused. It's a dorky term, but it just means like you're, you're solely focused on one thing. Like, he was solely focused on singing. To develop that kind of mastery over that skill, and, and and you just rarely see that today. So it's such a breath of, breath of fresh air. Many people think that he was just, you know, given by God with such a gift. And yes and no. He has a gift, but do not think that he hasn't trained and trained and trained every day consistently. Robert Greene, mastery for singing and for everything else. Leave a comment, don't you think he's like a fine-tuned piano? He 
can see it in his head. <laughs> Every time! Gives me goosebumps, man. Goosebumps, man. So that's what you call going between staccato and legato phrasing in an insane way, how he's staccato, he's punching every note, and then by the end of that melody, he connects those two note transitions so beautifully, wow! Did you see that? It's a Masha's whistle. You gotta watch this. It was so powerful. It made some kid behind him start doing like back bends and handstands and what do you call it? A cartwheel. I'm like tempted to try a cartwheel on camera, but everybody would unsubscribe. So I'll spare you on that. Watch this, ladies. <laughs> they can't even help it. Dimash. If Dimash whistled like that in front of me, shoot, I'd be doing some back bends away too. I couldn't handle it. I'd just be doing handstands and handstands. Jeez, man. What kind of... What kind of man do you know with a whistle register that'll make people like do freaking handstands and back bends? Okay, that, that's the last time I'll talk about that. <laughs> I'm like not letting that one go. It's not even that funny. <laughs> It's effortless to this man. Staccato was his breakfast, that's great. On another level. So let me just say, let me just say something too, for all those that want to learn to sing. That's why I always encourage when when you know students come to us, they come to singer. It's like, what do you want? Like, what is your end goal? Because I think sometimes people can look at a Dimash who has been training. I mean, he's been given a gift, but my man's been training so much. It can be intimidating. I think maybe that's the the best term for it. Is some people can watch this and say, my gosh, I can never be a singer because I'm not going to be an alien like Dimash. There can be one Dimash. Let's be real. And the other thing I want to say is that a lot of people, you know, what they want is they want a career as a singer or they want to have a hit song on the radio. And if that's what you want, you can get that. Even if you have a bad voice right now, I, I cannot tell you that you're going to be a Dimash. I think there's only one Dimash, but you can get to a level where you can be comparable to people that are making hits right now. Because also what's trending right now isn't, let's be real, it's not super vocally challenging. It's just not. And we can get you there very quickly. And then from there, you can just keep taking it to the next level and the next level. But it's just always so important so you don't get too intimidated when I'm reacting to people who are just out of this world. They're aliens. OK, I'm pretty sure they're aliens. What do you want? You know, what is it that you really want deep down when you think about singing? And then let's go after that. And you don't need to be intimidated by these insane vocalists because you don't necessarily at all, honestly, need to be at a comparable level to create hit songs for people to love your voice and for you to be able to live out your dreams when it comes to singing. Just want to encourage you there. Jeez. That was an out of this world blend too. It's 
too much. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That is what you call a powerful vibrato. Jeez, man. Demolish has me scared out of my mind. <laughs> I'm doing weird stuff. <laughs> Only Demolish, I promise you, watch my channel. Sometimes I freak out, okay? Especially, cheers, when I'm caffeinated. What do you expect? What do you expect? I love that delay. Oh my, I have never heard that is. Wow. Oh. Mm. The vocal cords are just barely touching between us and the under. Oh my gosh. I've never heard these. Thank you, Rahmet. Oh, I've never heard this before. I thought I heard everything from the Mosh. I, I mean, I know obviously I haven't heard everything, but my goodness, at least on the compilations, those were insane. Okay, leave me a comment right now. What do you think? For those interested in singing, I want to clarify a few things. You might be wondering what the heck is on the screen over here. And that is a singing program called Singer. That's exactly what my community uses to learn to sing. Now, I want you to imagine what it's going to feel like when you have your dream voice. You might be thinking that you can't get that voice because it's going to take way too long and you're busy. You don't have time for that because maybe you think you don't have a natural singing voice. That is totally reasonable. That's actually exactly what I first thought when I was starting. But I will tell you that every successful member on Singer who developed a great voice, at first, they were super doubtful about their voice. Singer is broken down into phases to make something complex like learning to sing easy and fun. And almost everyone in my community says that when they get through phase one, they hear a drastic improvement in their voice. Phase one has four singing lessons in it. So let's say that you do a lesson a day. Well, that's four days. So I don't know what your version of a time commitment is, but for me, if I can hear an improvement in four days, like a serious improvement, that's pretty good. The next thing you might be thinking is that it's just gonna be way too expensive to learn. And to be honest, it kind of is for all of the other options like one-on-one -on -one lessons and other expensive courses that have these little hidden monthly fees attached in there. But with Singer, you can get started for free with that free lesson. And if you wanna upgrade to the full product, the plans are super affordable and it's all a one-time fee. You don't wanna be paying ongoing monthly for this. You want an affordable price that you pay one time and then you get access to everything Thing for life. You might be thinking that learning online won't work, and I totally get that, but our community actually prefers online. If you need personal help while you're going through the lessons on Singer, or maybe you just want some feedback on your voice, or you want to meet some friends or meet people you can collaborate with, you can join the Singer community. Now, in that community, there's over 1,000 singers from all around the world who will mentor you, who will help you, who could also even become lifelong friends because you know that you share that similar interest. And as far as learning through the online lessons, I recommend that you check out the success stories page on the site. It's different reviews from singers who have gone through the program. You can hear befores and afters. There is no reason why you can't do it. I think the only thing that's stopping you is just having a structured approach. You know, searching through YouTube all the time, there's not that structured approach. So I think by you having this structured approach where you know what you're doing, you just just log in, do your lesson, ask your question to the community, and then the next day you do the next lesson, that's when you're really going to improve day by day. You're gonna have a completely changed voice. You're gonna be like, what the heck happened? All right, so much love for you. Don't ever give up on your dreams. Hopefully I will see you inside the singer community. I'd love to welcome you into that.